Hey everyone, this is Daryl, aka The D from the Simply Incredible Podcast, and today we're going over our weekly comic book, pop vinyl, and action figure haul, and let's see, we got, well first off, no action figures this week, couldn't find anything, so yeah, that's alright, we'll start off with the comics, we have comics and some pops this week, so that's pretty cool. We'll start off with the uh, Marvel and the Miscellaneous, as you can see, only four. <laughs> Uh, I don't know why. I, lately, I've not been finding very much Marvel that really interests me. Um, so, you know, hopefully in the next little bit, I'll, I'll start finding more that I really like. But right now, we start off with um, Steve Rogers, Captain America number four. And this is a Civil War tie-in. Civil War two, which great cover. Got Ms. Marvel, not Ms. Marvel, Captain Marvel. Darn, I keep doing that. Captain Marvel, uh, Iron Man, and Captain America on the front. I'm really liking the series so far, the, the Steve Rogers series. I'm really liking that. Uh, next, Star Wars number 22. There we go. Seems like this is actually behind um, Darth Vader, because Darth Vader, I think they started right about the same time. Maybe Star Wars might have started before it. I'm not sure, but thinks uh, Darth is up to 24, uh, and I believe they only had 25. I'm not sure if Star Wars is going to end at 25 like Darth is, or they just gonna keep going or, or what, but it's a good series and that's a really cool cover. <laughs> oh, the fighters coming out of there. That looks awesome. Really good, really cool, really cool. Uh, then we got two and one's an image, one's a Valiant. And this one actually came out last week and I did not, I didn't even know it come out. And this is um, not the original, this is the uh, variant, the third variant in it. Um, Spawn kills everyone, number one. I'm really interested in how this is going to go. I just saw that. I was like, that's interesting. I remember that there was a, a Deadpool kills the, the Marvel Universe. And so I'm really interested as to what's going to happen with this. It's like, there's an Iron Man. There's a, looks like a Batman cow, a um, Spider-Man, Captain America. It's all kinds of stuff. And you know, kind of mixed in, into the stuff there. So... Should be interesting, even though, you know, if you notice, it doesn't actually have the star on it. So, and you know, it's not exactly like the, the Iron Man stuff, but I'm interested in that. We'll see what's going on. And um, this was one I was also interested in. And this is actually a second printing of this. And when it first came out, I totally missed it. And I think number two may have come out today. And I don't know why I didn't pick that up too. <laughs> but Faith. Uh, she's a superhero. She is, uh, she's not your typical little skinny, t tiny superhero, super, superheroine, excuse me. And I've heard nothing but huge reviews from this. So I am um, picked it up, check it out, and let's see how it is because I'm hoping it's good because like I say, everyone that I've heard that's actually read this has said it's really, really good. So we'll check that out. Next, DC. We have a whole bunch in the um, that's kind of in their own new series in the Rebirth era, so to speak. But before we get into that, we have Harley's Little Black Book number four, and in this one we uh, have the DC bombshells mixed in. We got kind of the New Fifty Two, um, uh, not not that one, the other one. <laughs> this one is <laughs> more like the New Fifty Two, the new uh, new look for Harley mixed in with the, the bombshells. And you see on the bombs back there, we have all the different bombshells back there, which I'm really interested in this one. I, I can't wait to dig into this one. It looks good. It looks very good. Uh, next, Rebirth. This is the, uh, a new Rebirth title from the actual Rebirth line. And it is Blue Beetle. So we'll check that out, see how it is. There we go. Really interesting to see that. I wonder if they're going to have like a new origin for him, like they're doing with a, a lot of them. And the variant. I love these variants. I say it every week. I love the DC logo underneath it. I, again, if they make action figures, I'll be buying them all. Because I just think that looks amazing. And next, Action Comics number 962. And you see... Doomsday and Superman battling through the Action Comics logo right there. Looks awesome. And it kind of reminds me, um, people older will, will recognize this. It used to be a Schoolhouse Rocks, and they had that, that logo, and you see like breaking and crumbling behind them. So that kind of looks like that. 
Next, we have the uh, variant of that issue with uh, Doomsday again. Uh, we got Wonder Woman down there. You know what I picked up? Didn't even realize Wonder Woman was on there, but there she is. So, really, really liking the series so far. Uh, Batgirl, right there. This is uh, number one, no, number two, excuse me, number two. Uh, cool cover. I really like that cover. And But this cover right here, for me, this is the cover of the week for me. Um, I train mixed martial arts, and that's why I got so many bruises now, as you guys will see. But <laughs> but um, love it. Love Muay Thai kickboxing. I love Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. But this right here just looks awesome to me. It's got her in that fighting stance. You know, getting ready to throw that cross. Looks awesome. Looks great. And I was telling one of my friends, I was like, you know what? That looks just like you out there. Yeah, she she's a she's a tough one, and um, so that looks awesome. Could could very easily be her. Looks amazing. Uh, next we have Detective Comics number nine thirty nine. There we go. There, got Robin making his appearance in there. Looks awesome. Red Robin. Boom. And we got the variant copy. Is this one the variant? Is that one the variant? Yeah, that one's the variant. Couldn't remember which one was which. There we go. Awesome looking cover. I like that. That looks really, really cool. Uh, next, uh, Deathstroke, uh, number one. I just got the regular copy for the, actually the variant. Yep, the variant copy from this one. I think that, lo that looks really, really cool. The other one looked good, but I just like this one a little bit better. Uh, next, we have The Flash, Barry's Day Off. There you go. I like that. When I first saw it, I thought it was like a 3D cover because it's got that blur, but it's not, but it still looks really, really awesome. That is number five in the series. Yep, number five. Next, the Titans. I was only going to get one of these, but both of these covers, I think, look really, really awesome. And this is, is this the regular one? Yep, this is the regular on the Titans, which I think looks really cool with the marionettes. And... This one right here, wow. I just think this looks incredible. There you go. That's the variant copy. I, I just love that. That To me, that is just amazing artwork right there. I just, wow. That to me is phenomenal. Just absolutely phenomenal. But uh, let's see, who did that? Does it say? Actually, I do not see on there the artist for that, but I just think it looks incredible. And last in the comics this week, I got the uh, Wonder Woman number five and uh, the variant on that one. Is that right? Nope. This one's the variant. Sorry. This is the regular one. <laughs> there you go. It looks really, really cool. Yeah, fighting through the woods. <laughs> that looks awesome back there. I did it. That Swamp Thing back there. There we go. Um, and here's the thing. This week, I forgot to get a list ready. So I hope I didn't miss anything. I might have. I don't know. Uh, and last, I picked up two Pops. Um, I finally found some of the Impopsters. Not Impopsters, Impopsters. Uh, this one is Poison Ivy. Dressed up as Batgirl. Which I think looks really, really amazing. There we go. Poison Ivy. There's the back. There's the side of her. I think that looks really, really cool. <laughs> and we found uh, the Harley Quinn dressed up as Batman. Uh, you know I was going to pick that up. And there's also one of her dressed up as, as Batgirl as well, but I have not seen that one. So I, I'm not sure. I know they were saying that some of them are kind of separated about a month apart. So maybe next month those will come in. But I think that looks great. And that's the, if you can see it well there, got the whole series of them back there. You got uh, Penguin, Two-Face, Harley, and is that all Miss Batman? Nope. Um, Scarecrow and the Riddler as Batman. And you have Harley and uh, Ivy as Batgirl. So I definitely, I definitely want to get that one up there. Um, the Riddler one looks really cool as well. Scarecrow. Okay, I'm probably going to be getting all of them. Who am, I, who am I kidding? Who am I kidding there? But uh, that's that's my haul so far for this week. Uh, I don't think anything else is coming in. I know we should have some more boxes coming in before long. 
so I can do some more uh, unboxings. It seems like they're all waiting toward the end of the month and nothing nothing toward the beginning. So that kind of stinks. But that's all right. Now, that's all we got today. And you guys have an incredible day.